bottom right hand corner. As I said, 12 tons a day we can do, which is 30 of those wind bins. So the ginger goes in, it'll then go up the ramp you can see going up there. It'll go into the big steel box which washes all the solution off it. Then onto the orange conveyor belt where you get up to six people cutting the stalks and stems off, which is the base of the plant and the root system. That can go back to the farmers for mulch and nothing's wasted. The ginger then goes up the yellow conveyor belt through a cutting machine. So we cut it to about four or five different shapes or sizes at a time. The green conveyor belt sends the ginger through a selection of sieves. Depending on the size and shape, it will fall through the corresponding sieve into the waiting bin below. Now, if we want to sort the fibre content out, which is the long stringy bit in ginger, we put it through the steel, steel machine in the middle of the room with the four red rollers on the front. Now, the ginger goes into a bath. The solution lets the ginger float at different levels depending on its weight. Now, fibre is what makes ginger heavy and light. 